We want to find an estimate of mu of mu. We want to find an estimate of mu of mu. We could give a point, but could be wrong. So an interval will be far more strong for the population mean that's known as mu. For the population mean that's known as mu. This interval is x bar plus minus plus minus. This interval is x bar plus minus plus minus plus minus. What I hear you say is z times st over root n, which is also known as z times standard error. Which is also known as z times standard error. The z is found by pressing inverse normal, inverse normal. The z is found by pressing inverse normal, inverse normal. And now we are a percentage sure the population mean is quite purely in the interval we've now found. Yes, in the interval we cleverly found. We want to find an estimate of mu, of mu. We want to find an estimate of mu, of mu. We could give a point, but could be wrong. So an interval will be far more strong for the population mean that's known as mu. For the population mean that's known as mu. This interval is x bar plus minus plus minus. This interval is x bar plus minus plus minus. Plus minus what I hear you say It's z times st over root n Which is also known as z times standard error The z is found by pressing inverse normal Inverse normal The z is found by pressing inverse normal Inverse normal And now we are a percentage sure The population mean is quite purely in the We've now found Yes, in the interval We cleverly found We want to find an estimate of mu Of mu We want to find an estimate of mu Of mu We could give a point but could be wrong So an interval will be far more strong For the population Mean that's known as mu For the population Mean that's known as mu The interval is x bar plus minus plus minus. The interval is x bar plus minus plus minus plus minus. What I hear you say it's z times st over root n, which is also known as z times standard error. The z is found by pressing inverse normal inverse normal. The z is found by pressing inverse normal, inverse normal. And now we are a percentage sure the population mean is quite purely in the interval we now found. Yes, in the interval we cleverly found.